On April 15, 1967, a U-2 was spotted over France's nuclear facilities, and a French Mirage 3 was already on its way to the aircraft. But wait, a U-2 flies at 70,000 feet, and a Mirage 3 can only reach 56,000 feet, right? When the French pilot reached some 45,000 feet, he activated SEPR rocket booster, which helped his aircraft quickly accelerate to Mach 1.8 and reach 65,000 feet. The Mirage's supersonic shock wave surprised the U-2 pilot, and soon he was shocked again by the appearance of the Mirage. The French pilot's aim was not to shoot the aircraft down, but to take his camera out and take photographs for proof. By the way, he nearly collided with the U-2 while taking pictures. The Mirage 3E was now short on fuel, so the pilot switched off the booster and returned to Dijon Longvic Air Base. After this incident, the U.S. stopped all such flights over France, 